This is a letter to my 18 year old self. Dear Cassie, your life is about to change so much more than you can even imagine. Going out of state for college is probably one of the best decisions that you'll ever make. You'll make great friends and then not so great ones. You'll meet boys who don't deserve your time, but they'll make you stronger. You'll join a sorority and it will intimidate you so much at first, but please don't even think about giving up on it. Greek life will push you and help you to grow in so many ways and you'll meet some of your absolute best friends who your life would not be the same without. Your sorority life will also lead you to an opportunity to help found a chapter of a professional film fraternity. Embrace that and stick with it even when your schedule becomes tough to balance. Looking back, it's probably the best thing that you'll do in your college career and the people that you'll meet become family. Speaking of your schedule, you'll be busy and always will have a full course load because you're too ambitious for your own good. Remember to slow down once in a while and enjoy the late night Starbucks study sessions, the nights out with your sisters and friends, the lazy mornings with your freshman floor mates and then your friends that became roommates, the lectures that are actually about things that you're interested in. I could go on, but believe me, you'll miss all of those things one day. Remember to go out of your comfort zone and to say yes as much as you can. Most of the time, you'll have so much fun or you'll have a chance to grow and both are better than if you stayed home. On the flip side, don't hesitate to say no when you need to and take care of yourself. You'll thank yourself later. I know how much you love YouTube and making videos for fun right now. When things get busy, you'll be less consistent with uploading than you'll like, but don't ever let yourself give up. You'll lose touch with some of your OG YouTube friends, but that's just fate making room for amazing people that you'll meet because of YouTube over the next few years. Sticking with your passion for YouTube and the community will also lead you to go to many conventions and amazing events in a few years. You'll have some of the best weekends of your life. I promise it's worth it. Lastly, I want to remind you to love yourself for who you are and where you're at in this moment. I know sometimes you feel insecure, but please don't forget that everyone else does too. You're human. You'll never be perfect. And honestly, life gets so much better when you let go and stop worrying so much about ever what everyone else thinks and about doing your makeup and hair perfectly. Those things are great and so fun, but it's better to love them for that and not feel like you need them to show the world you're beautiful. You already are. Follow your gut and do your best to live each day to the fullest, and I promise you, you'll be fine. Much love, your 25-year-old self. So this video was definitely a little bit different. I've seen it done before, and I really just thought it was a cool idea and a different concept, and so I decided to write a little letter and just see where it took me, and these were the things that I came up with, the things I wish that I could say to my 18-year-old self. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and listening and really just being here with me through kind of this interesting period that I'm in where I'm really just kind of trying to find my way and post different types of videos and things that I'm excited about and that I really want to share with you guys. If anything in this video resonated with you and you did enjoy it, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and please go ahead and subscribe down below if you're new here. I would absolutely love to have you join the Curly Hair Love fam. If you have anything that you wish you could tell your younger self, please leave them down in a comment below. I would absolutely love to hear what you guys think and you know the advice that you would give because I think we all have such different experiences and these kinds of things are so interesting and what you share might help other people. So please make sure to share something down below and don't be a ghost watcher. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for listening and watching this video. I love you so much and I will see you next week. Bye. Burn this shit up.